So Alex deposits X dollars in the bank and it earned 8% annual interest. So the way you calculate interest is 0.08 times however much you put in the bank, compounded annually. So of course this is gonna, there's a one understood there. So this is 1.08X. And one year later, Alex deposited an additional X dollars into the account. So now we got 1.08X dollars plus another X dollars. Uh, if there were no other transactions and if account combined contained W dollars at the end of two years, which is the following, it's okay, it's expressed in terms of W. So let's calculate interest on this new amount. So that's going to be 1.08x plus x is how much money is in the bank. And if we multiply that by 1.08, that's going to automatically, you know, add, uh, include the interest. And they say that's equal to W. And I look at my answers and they're fractions. So what I need to do is solve this for X. That's what I need to find. So let's think about that. Let's um, look at how, what format the answers are in. Let's distribute this 1.08. So that's gonna be 1.08 squared X plus 1.08x equal w. And I think your answer is gonna be d because when you factor that x out, you're left with 1.08 squared plus 1.08 equal w and then solve, you know, divide both sides by this factor and it gives you w over 1.08 squared plus 1.08. But I saw that was going to happen back up here, so you can save you some time by just stopping. That's answer D.